Hello, Silver Sneakers people. Welcome to class today. It's so fun to be here. I'm so excited to do this with you. I miss you very much. You're the highlight of my week. So I hope you're out there watching today, and I hope you can go back and, and rewatch this video over and over again and keep getting your workouts in until we can get back together. So we're going to have to do things a little bit differently today because we don't have all the equipment at your home. I'm assuming most of you don't have all the equipment that you need. So you do need a chair still. We're going to use the chair mostly just to hold our stuff, and we will use the chair for our cool down after we have finished working out. Um, but other than that, it's just going to be there for your balance. So make sure you have a chair that's sturdy and has a high back so you can just put your hands on it and you don't have to reach low to grab it. Okay, as far as weights go, if you have hand weights at home, grab those, um, use those, because we will be using hand weights today. A couple of different options you can use. I'm going to use water bottles. Okay, so if you have bottled water at home or even water bottles that you can fill with water, that will give you a little bit of weight, okay? Also, another option would be soup cans. So they're a little fatter to hold, so if that's painful for your hands, the water bottle is a great option. If you don't have either of those or don't want to use those, you don't have weights, just do the movement without adding weight, and you'll be just fine, okay? Um, also, we're not going to be sitting, I think I told you that. Um, so how about you put one on the, on the chair and then a water bottle that you can drink from because we're still going to take our water breaks and we're going to warm up standing. We're sitting standing most of the time. If you need to sit, your chair is there. Okay? All right, let's get warmed up. Let's march right, left, right, right. Then you go opposite. Does it matter? Okay, four, three, two, let's do heels, heel, heel, heel. Yeah. All right, guys, let's add our arms. Open and close. Open and close. Make sure your abs are tight. You gotta warm up the shoulders. Want to get that core temperature going. Keep going with heels. Let's do four more heels. Three, two. Now let's do circles with our arms and just march. Little circles forward, little circles. Okay, let's make it a little bigger. Keep it slow. A little bigger. And then let's stop. Let's reverse it the other way. Keep it small. Keep it small. Then make it a little bigger. Let's get those shoulder joints warmed up. A little bigger. All right, drop it down. Inhale up. And let's shake those hands out all the way down. Okay, let's go back to heels in front. Right, left, right. Left. Add those arms again. Four more. Three. Now we're going to tap the toes to the side. Just tap. Step tap. Let's reach across the chest. Nice long stretch. Now reach overhead. Three and long. Four more. Now swing those arms. Just swing. Nice job. Four more. Four, three, two, down, march. Right, right. Take your feet up. This is the part. We're going to squat down and back. Here we go. Down and lift. So imagine your chair is behind you. You want to sit back in your heels. Try not to let those knees go past your toes. Just like you're sitting in the chair. Four more. Nice and slow. Three, two, and one. Okay, sit back right here. We're going to hold set. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, four, three, two. Now reach up overhead as long as you can. And shake those hands up all the way down. All right, come in close enough to your chair. You can hold onto the chair. Outside leg, we're going to lift it up. Grab on underneath that thigh and roll that in slow. Reverse it. All right, let's point and flex that toe. Slow. Slow. One more slow. Now go faster to six, five, three, two, one. Flex back and hold. Good. Extend that leg straight and then drop that foot forward. Bend the standing knee. Keep that chest lifted and just tip and toe 
cover. Okay, stay on this leg, reach out over the toe. We're gonna stand up. One, two, then sit back. One, two, up, and back. Two more, up, and back. One more time, make sure you get a stretch on that hamstring. Now hold it right here. Keep reaching over the toe. Okay, now drop that arm down and swing it all the way up. Okay, we both feet and feet together. Let's lift to the ceiling and tip over towards the chair. Nice long stretch. All right, let's bring it up and down. Let's walk to the other side of our chair. Hold the chair for balance. Outside leg, pick it up off the floor and roll the ankle. And snap that joint. Let's go the other direction. Now point and flex. Nice and slow. One more slow. Now speed it up. Six, five, four, three, two. Now flex and hold. Good. Extend that leg straight. Drop that heel to the floor. Bend that standing knee. Sit those hips back and keep that chest lifted. And reach out over the toe. Hold that stretch. We're going to stand. One, two. Sit back for two. Stand. Two. Back. For two, good. Two counts up. Two counts down. One more time. Two counts up. Two counts back. Hold right here. Reach over the toe. Good. Drop that arm down and swing it all the way up. Nice and tall. Bring those feet together. Lift up to the ceiling. Sit forward towards the chair. Stretch all the way down into that waist. Now stand it up. Bring that arm all the way down. Okay, shake everything out. Go ahead and grab your first drink of water. And we're going to go back to the other side of our chair. We always start on this side. So get a little step. We're going to do a little cardio section first. So when you're ready, I want you to just march. Right, right, right. Wait for everybody to join us. Make sure you get some water. Big deep breaths. All right, we're gonna do heels in front, just like we did in warm up. Do heels, heels, four, three. Now tap those toes to the side, tap, tap. Let's reach across the chest, nice and long. Okay, overhead, reach at top, up, 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 up. Four, three, now swing those arms, swing. Excellent, four more, four, Three, okay, now we're gonna squat. Down, lift, down, lift. Two more. Now sit and pulse it for four. Three, two, reach overhead. Four, three, two, reach overhead. We're gonna do two more of those. Reach, one more. Reach and shake those hands out. All the way down. Okay, bring those feet together. March it. Okay, can you go ahead and grab your water bottles or you can grab your soup hands or your hand weights. If you don't have any of those, we just need to do without weights in our hands. Okay, let's do a bicep curl. Halfway, all the way, halfway, down. Make sure you stop and stop right in the center. If you want to march, you can march. Halfway, all the way, halfway, down. Let's do two more of those. Last one. Okay, come halfway back up and hold it right here. Okay, stop your feet. We're going to tap our toes. Right toe, left toe. Let's open those arms. So just rotate from the shoulders. Keep those toe taps going. If the legs confuse you, remember, just do your upper body. That's the most important. Two more. Okay, go ahead and open and hold right here. Open and hold. We're going to pulse it for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and release it all the way down. Let's march our feet. Hips, kick back, hips, and reach for the floor. Hips, kick back, hips, reach. Hips, kick back, hips, reach. Hips, Kick that. Okay, let's do two more like that. And then change it just a little bit, okay? One more like that. Okay, keep your 
your arms down, turn those palms to the back wall, and we're going to do a straight arm lift behind us. We're still turning those triceps, so you're also getting the back of your shoulder here. Let's go. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, take your arms a little bit wider, and then stop your feet. We're going to do a squat, and a lateral raise, right on. Lateral raise, left arm. Good. Remember to just come shoulder height on that lateral raise. Okay? Targeting the top of the shoulder and your quads on the front of that leg. Okay? Keep going. Let's do one more on each arm. Right. Squat and left. Now with arms, we're going to do up, right go for two, release it for two. Remember your elbows should be a little bit above your wrists. So bring those weights about uh, chest height. Elbows should be about shoulder height. Starting to the top of the shoulder again. Okay, let's do one more like that and I'm gonna change it a little bit. Let's take it all the way up. You're gonna rotate those arms back, forward, release. Up, back, forward, release. Up, back, forward, release. Good. Back. One more time. And release it. All right, go ahead and put your weight through your water bottles, whatever, back on your chair. Get a little sip of water. We're going to do another cardio section. Make sure you breathe. Okay, when you're ready, take your time, get your water. Just march right, left, right. Right. Okay, we're going to go out, out, in, in. So we're going to go out wide, back together, out wide, back together, out, out, in, in. Four more. Two more. Okay, now when you go out, out, I want you to come forward just a little bit and back together, out, out, in, in. This is called the feet step. If you want to add arms, you go out, out, double clap. Double clap. Up, double clap, double clap, four more, two, now heels in the front, again heels, two, three, four more, four, three, tap the toes to the side, reach across the chest, four more, make sure you have a nice long reach, overhead, all the way to the ceiling, four, those arms. Very good. Four, three, now squat. Down, lift, down, lift. Let's do two more. Squat. Now sit down and pulse. Back, rock, step, 
There you go. Come together. Right foot, rock step. Two more. Three together. Left foot. Very good. Two more. All right. Let's march with right foot. March. March. Very nice. Get a drink of water. And pick up your weights again. Let's do a little more weights for our arms. And we're going to do a little more for our legs.
So this time your hips stay under, chest stays lifted. Make sure your feet are wide enough that your knees don't go over your toes, okay? Keep going. Four, three, two, down. Three down, and we're going to pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it up. Walk those feet together. Toe, 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 toe. All right. Put both bottles or weights on your chair. Come behind your chair and hold on to it for balance. I'm going to step to the side so you can see me. Hands on the chair if needed, okay? Alternating hands can go. These are slow, so go right, then left. Right, left. Good, right. Make sure you're squeezing that hamstring. Tight, tight. One more slow. Three, two, okay, right leg only fast. Curl, tap, curl, tap, curl, tap. If you can't tap all the way to the floor, just keep that toe off the floor. Just do a pulse. You can feel that hamstring start to turn a little. Let's do eight more. Eight, seven, four, three, two. Other leg, go fast. Left leg, fast. Curl, tap, curl, tap. We can keep it off the floor. You don't want to tap it all the way back down to the floor if that's too much, okay? You just want to get that movement in there. Tighten those hamstrings. They're really hard to target without weight. Give me eight, four, seven, four, three, two, release it down. And then just shake those hips out a little bit. Make it a little tight. Check it out, check it out. Okay, let's do tick tops. So we're gonna go right leg side, left leg side. Hold your chair, you can hold your both hips. Stay behind your chair, okay? Take your time, if the music's too fast, take your time. Just do it your own tempo, okay? Out of five. Okay, we're gonna do four more. So that's two on each leg. One more on each leg. And then shake those hips again. Shake them, shake them. Very nice. Okay, come to the right side of your chair. Grab some water. You can get a little drink. If you need more water breaks than I'm giving you, you know you can take water break anytime. Okay, let's do another little cool cardio. What I'm gonna do is do everything that we've already done. Put it all together. Maybe add a little bit on the end. And we'll see how we feel at the end of that, okay? So just march. Right, right. After you get your water, come and join us on the march. Okay, here we go. Heels in front with the arms. Heels. Tap those toes to the side. Tap. Go ahead and reach. Cross that chest. Four more. Reach overhead. Keep that toe tap going. Four, three. Swing those arms. Sweep, sweep. Keep that toe tap going. Four, three. Now wide squat. Down, lift. Down, lift. Sit down and hold. Two, three, four, four more. Three. Two, march with right foot. March, march. Let's go out, out, and in. Out, out, in, in. Step that a little bit forward, a little bit back. Do the arms if you want to. Now rock step, right foot. Forward step, back step, or forward step together. Change place, left foot rock step. Two more, let's step. I'm going to throw you for a loop. V step. Out wide. On the left foot. Out wide. Out wide. Good. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Good. March it. Right. 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 Very nice. Let's take a deep breath right here. Inhale up. And 
take those hands out. Oh yeah. All right. Let's do our water bottle one more time. If you need some water to drink, get some now. Grab the weights. Put the weights you're using. Never you can do this without any weight at all. The best. I will do it without weight. So you can do it without weight. Okay? We're going to go up two, down two, bicep curl. So if you have weights, remember those weights. If you don't have weights, you can do the same thing without the added weight, okay? Bicep curl up two, down two. Let's do that one more time. Up two, down two. Now you're going to do your right arm to the left shoulder, left arm to the right shoulder. Bring it across the body. You don't have to touch the shoulder, remember, just come towards the shoulder, so you're bringing that bicep across the body a little bit, okay? Four more goes. Four, three, two, and one. All right, go ahead and put one of your water bottles on the bed, on the um, chair. Hold the water bottle in your right hand, okay? We're gonna step behind the chair, but we're gonna stay to the side, okay? Left hand is free, so go ahead and put your hands on the chair and then step forward with your left foot. Now from here, we're going to drop our chest a little bit, let that arm hang down, and we're going to roll back. So you're going to keep your arm in tight to your body, okay? And squeeze that shoulder blade. Squeeze, reach to the floor, reach to the floor. Okay, two more like that, and then I'm going to change it. Do a side raise. Keep that chest dropped. And just do a side raise. Work in that same muscle. Just a little bit of lever on that. Okay? Keep squeezing that shoulder blade. Release it. Stand up tall. And bring those feet together. Okay. Go ahead and put your hand on your chair. We're going to lunge our right foot forward. And then we're going to press back. So you should just have one way or you can do this without any weight. You just do your body weight. Go on your lunges, you step forward and then you drop, and then you press that off that heel. Okay? Off that heel. Couple more. Last one. Good. All right, let's go to the other side of our chair. We're going to start with the low backs and the reverse slide. So, Come behind the chair that stays in the side. Inside leg is going to lunge forward and your hands will be on the chair. Okay, drop that chest, get the arm reach, roll back. Remember to squeeze that shoulder blade. Squeeze. Squeeze. Keep going. Two more. One. Okay, now do a side raise. This is called a reverse fly. So you want to bring the arm up and squeeze that shoulder blade. If you're worried about the tempo, just go a little bit slower than the tempo. You don't have to go for the music. use it. It is a long lever, so it should take you a little more time. Let's do two more. One. And two, and stand it up straight. Okay, bring your feet together. You should be right next to your chair, and on the chair for balance. Inside leg is going to lunge, and then press back. Step, drop, and then push back off that heel. Step, drop, push back off that heel. Drop, push back off that heel. So you're targeting your quads on that one leg. You're also targeting your glutes and your hamstrings. Okay? Push off the heel. One more time. Push off the heel. Very nice. Let's march our feet right up. Let's shake our arms out a little bit. So go ahead and put your weight down. Grab some water. We're going to do one more little cardio section. And then we're going to go into our cool down. And when we cool down, we'll have a seat on our chair. Okay? Look so at your water, and let's come back to the right side of our chair. Okay, we're going to mash everything together again. I'm going to add a little tiny thing on the end. 
then we'll go in turn and go down, okay? Just keep marching, right, left? Take your time, get your water, whatever you need to do, okay? Think about your core, abs tight, make sure it's tight all the time, chest lifted, okay? Heels in front, right, left, right, left, up your arms. Toe tap to the side and reach across the chest. Come back, yeah. Four, three, reach overhead, long. Four more, four, three. Now, sweep those arms, sweep. Good, keep that toe tap going. Four, three, now wide squat. Down, lift, down, sit back in those heels. Now, sit down and pull. Back, back, back. Four, three. Now reach over the head nice and long. Open those arms. Bring those feet together and march. Stay, let's go out, out, breathe in. Out, out. Out, out. Out, out. Rock step, right foot. Forward, back, or forward step together. Ready? One more, other leg, rock step, left leg. Forward step, back step, or forward step together. Left foot, V step, out wide. We're going to step forward a little bit. Now march, left, left, good job. Four more, four, three. Okay, we're going to do jump ropes right here. So don't lift your feet up the floor, you're just lifting your heels. Onto the floor, good one. To the balls of your feet. On that little jump rope. Okay, on the fourth count, we're going to push to our toes. One, two, three, push. One, two, three, push. 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 Four more. Two more. We got it. Heart right. Oh, let those legs rest a little bit. Very nice. Okay, let's do a couple of things for our calves and then we'll go into our cool down. Hold the chair to the two, toes parallel. We're going to do the same thing, we're just going to push our toes and drop those heels. So you're going to fill this in your calves. Let's do four more. Four, three, two. Okay, now walk back on your heels, turn your toes just in a natural turnout, and then press to the toes. Right to the balls of the feet, okay? Four more. Four, three, two, one. All right, rock back on those heels. Turn those toes back together. Let's march. Right, left. Very nice. All right, let's go ahead and have a seat on our chair. So we're going to take everything off your chair. Everything, everything. Hold it in your hands and then have a seat. We're going to put everything on the floor. Make sure you step to the side of your chair to put everything down. Okay? All right. Let's get up towards the front end of our chair. We're going to take a big breath up right here. Inhale up. You guys did an excellent job. Exhale out. Let's do that one more time. Slow up. Exhale, roll that air out. Okay, we're going to drop our chin to the front. Okay, so drop that chin towards your chest. Stretch up the back of the neck. Then come center. You're going to take your right ear and you're going to drop it towards your right shoulder. You don't lift your shoulder. Keep those shoulders pressed down. Stretch the side of the neck. Come center and drop that ear over to the other shoulder. So left ear towards your left shoulder. Down your ear, and then have you drop your chin, you're going to roll your head all the way over to the side, and then do that the other direction. Drop your chin, roll it over, so that ear is right over the shoulder. Okay, go ahead and bring that head center. Take your arms out the front. I'm going to have you lace your fingers together, press the hands forward. Now from here, I want you to push your chest back, so you're grounding those shoulders a little bit. You can drop your head forward to so increase that stretch on that upper back and the back of that neck. Okay, go ahead and 
Straighten out your spine, sit up nice and tall. Okay, arms come overhead. Let's take our left hand down to our back. Right hand is going to touch the back of the shoulder. Now, if you want to use your left hand, press that out back a little further if you can. Stretch that tricep. So you're going to feel a little stretch in the back, so right on the side of that back. That's what you want. Okay, extend that arm up and then drop it in front of you. Grab onto it with your left hand. Come on, arm in tight. Drop the shoulder. We're going to squeeze and open those fingers. Open. Open. One more time. Now we're going to go faster. Squeeze, open. Squeeze, open. Squeeze, open. Three, two, one. Now roll to this. Open the arm to the side. And bring it all the way down. Very nice. Let's take our left hand up towards the ceiling. Touch the back of the shoulder. If you want a more stretch, take that right hand. Press that elbow back. Keep your spine a little bit tall. Abs tight. Extend that arm up. Drop it across the chest. Grab onto it, pull it in, and then drop that shoulder down. Nice stretch along the back of that shoulder. Up and back, let's squeeze and open those fingers. Go slow first, get a tight fist. Spread those fingers. Now go faster. Squeeze, open, squeeze, open, squeeze, open. Two, one, roll the wrist to the side and bring it all the way down. Very nice. Keep your hands on your thighs. Relax those shoulders down. Take your right foot and extend it out in front of you. All right, now, keep your back flat, out tight, and you can get hip over and stretch the back of that leg. Go ahead and take that right hand and reach it over the toe again. Just keep your shoulder height. Keep reaching over that toe, get a nice long stretch. Okay, go ahead and bring that stretch all the way up to the ceiling, bring your foot in, and then open the arm. Okay, right foot still. We're going to cross the right foot over the ankle of the left foot. We're going to cross over the left knee. Okay? Then you're going to twist. You can pull it over your right shoulder. And you're looking at the back seat of your car. Make sure your spine is tall and lifted. And you just rotate the shoulder. Okay, untwist and uncross. Okay, left foot. Let's extend it out in front. Back nice and flat, get hinge over. Okay, let's take that left hand and reach it over the toe. Put it down, right leg right, right, right up your shoulder. But reach as far as you can over that toe. Stretch, nice and long at the back of that leg. Okay, let's go ahead and pick it up. And then open that arm all the way down. Okay, bring that left foot back. Cross the left foot over the right ankle. Both you cross the knee. And then twist and look over your shoulder. Shake those hands out all the way down. All right, let's go ahead and take our arms up to shoulder height. 
and open those arms to the side. Let's bring those hands back together. Inhale. Hold together. Exhale, bring it back towards your chest. Inhale, straight up to the ceiling. And exhale, open those arms. Blow all that air in your lungs. Give yourself a big hug and a big round of applause. You are fabulous, I'm sure. I hope you take the opportunity to go back and watch this over and over again. You can do the same workout every day. Keep those muscles working. Keep your heart rate going so you can keep in good shape until we can see you guys again. Thank you for joining me. Mwah.